Hello folks, this has gone spy. The spy will come to you live for Star Wars Stars for Public the Sith Lords. The Act 3. Now well, we have boarded the Ravager Sith ship that is commanded by Vesis' old Sith Master that is also a Sith Lord, also one of the leaders that leads one of the legions of the Sith that is attacking Telos right now. Now here's the thing, because that of us uh, destroying Parag is that Telos realizes fuel from, even though that we've already secured that fuel problem by already making deals with Fogo the Hut, it's not enough time to uh, get the fuel that uh, Telos needed to stay in orbit. Therefore, it cannot last much longer in the space battle with the Ravager that is currently attacking it, even though the Republic just arrived its reinforcements. Here's what I propose. Here's what we propose now. Here's the battle tactic we're going to be using since uh, Mandalore's uh, soldier, Kilborn, or Kex, was able to explain it. There are target sites of mine, sites that he was able to scout out, which will be uh, heading towards those locations at. We've each been given like a um, mine detonator, so uh, bombs that's going to place in each target site. Um, one we're going to need to look throughout the ship, but without doubt we'll be counting many of the Dark Jedi and Civ Troopers. Um, and perhaps uh, Sif Masters. So right now, uh, we're going to need to uh, stay in, stay sharp, and to be able to keep uh, on our toes and stay on guard. When there's no telling how many surprises that this uh, Sif's going to be throwing at us, even though the Mandalorians have already uh, secured our escape route uh, in case we need, you know, that we need to get out of the ship. But here's the thing, once that we've placed those charges, mines at the Sith target sites, uh, we're not going to be able to truly d destroy the ship or solve the problem. Once we do uh, place the charges, we're going to need to go to the bridge, which we're going to have to, because so long as the Sith Lord that controls the ship lives, uh, Teos will still be in danger because the Force uh, that Ned because that Sith Lord feeds off the force uh, of Telos. That's why uh, he went to Qatar in the first place. Not just because the Jedi gathering as a beacon uh, that draws him there, but because he feeds off the force. Any living force sensitives there? Which is why Kreia had led him here. Reason uh, we don't even know how he, he was able to know about it, but. Hopefully we'll be able to discover that answer real soon. So right now that is the battle strategy planned and that we're going with. So right now I'm working with only with Faces and Mandalore. Now, Faces and Mandalore has a difference of opinions towards each other and because Faces was Civ still is and Mandalore doesn't exactly trust her to get the job done, those two are going to need to work together, just like Handmaid and Faces need to work needed to work together back on Duxon at the Sith Pyramid of Freedom Nad's tomb. So right now, that's the hope and I'm willing to gamble on. So right now, let's get this started. Interesting. We're going to be having a surprise from behind that door, so let's get ready. I knew it. Here we go!
Grab a fire. I had to face him. I will stay with you for as long as I can. No, that is not exactly uh, true of what you speak of. The universe is not solely uh, as our eyes make it out to be, Thesis. Then let us look upon each other. As we already did back in the Ebon Hall before I arrived at Noah Polar, mind you. Now, let us resume the mission. Here we go. Force and Lightman. More incoming. All right, send so one the proton the mine cores. On it. Just hold your position. We'll set the rest of the charges. It may be an ambush.
I may use the Force, Lightning as a Dark Sided ability, but I am a balanced Jedi. I'm neither Jedi nor Sith. I'm an exile of both. I'm a Jedi that knows war and how to win wars. And I, and you being here is my fault, so I will fix my mistake, uh, and that is why I will destroy this hellish ship. Force channel, force points to be regeneration, and force damage to be doubled. Endurance activate. Interesting room. And I miss all day. We should come back to it later. Just in case. room. Alright, so in a proton core, Mark 2. Not good. Understood. Just try not to give any more ground. we got two more charges that's left to play. Just keep guarding the entry point. Is the only way out of here once we uh, have what we need once we've done the mission.
for Scream. I love that move. Shoots up. I like that you have a good humper mother humpers. Level up. Forrest Fowler. It's like a party. Let's join. Force Fowler Improved by the meditation. This tends to happen every once in a while, but it quickly wears off. Oh, sleep.
Another Jedi Knight robe. Alright, send a proton core mine, Mark III. Mandalorian, you have got to hold your position. I told you before already, it could be an ambush. If they're just adding this bait, we're almost done. Just hold on tight and you should be alright. Damn it! Alright, it looks like we're going to need to make another corm before we go to another target site, but where? Okay, maybe a long shot, but I think I know where we can do that. We may be able to make one, but we need to go uh, back to where we came. Not all the way, but uh, like another uh, down side to the left, uh, west, north, south, yes, west. The missile bay. It can we can be able to use this thing uh, to uh, make proton core, hopefully. We gotta find that console. Ah, uh, here it is. Overwriting emergency sequence. It's unlocked. It can be removed. We're moving Proton Core. Alright, now we can go to the next target site. Hoping that will be at the target site. This place is a maze. Can't believe the structure of this ship. Open. Colonel Tobin. What the hell is he doing here? Wait, there's something different about him? The expression, that facial change? That wasn't his original features. My god, he's in one with the dark side? That explains it. Have you come to kill me? A final insult. Stripping under on my soldiers, my home for me, only to have me die here. 
What the hell happened to you, Tobin? And so you gave yourself into it? Why did you ally w yourself to the Sith, Tobin? General Baku and I, when it seemed that we would need more to take on the rock, we need strong again. We gave its power and so many. It seemed as if there was nothing that we could not do. Nothing that we could not do to save us. And nothing you could do to stop him? This ship seems familiar. This ship. It is a graveyard of a terrible life. Everything on it slowly dies. As long as he hungers. It is the way of all life that serves him. In his presence, all life dies. This ship is from Malachor. This Sith Lord of yours bolsters his fleet with ships from that world. He's nothing more than a scavenger. I think he is of that place. If so, his power may be great and And the Jedi Masters were right. It's almost similar to what they said about me, too. Tobin, why did your master come here? The master suffers. If he cannot feed, then the hunger begins to consume him. The planet, Teos, may feed on something upon its surface to sustain him a while longer. But there's nothing here? Telos is a resurrected near dead world? Old woman. He means that Jedi witch you travel with, Kreia. Yes, the old woman on Ondor. She spoke of the Jedi Academy here on Tios, and my master was forced to come here. But Kreia told me that on Tilo, when we last on Tilos and Adrius' North Pole uh, and Holo Academy, uh, there were no Jedi there, only her servants. There are not Force users there. There are no Force users there but us. Then her lies will mean the planet's destruction. He will destroy all of Tilos. He will turn into fire again and crush the planet beneath him. But Katar? What if we didn't deny him, Telos? Then he will suffer. Without something to sustain him, I do not know what will happen. I think Kreia knows this well. He's been she's been drawing him out ever since so what happened? Ever since that you've loved to find us. If she lead Telos out to your lord, maybe she wanted him to come here, only to find nothing, just to make him suffer so I don't think so. It's not my place to die in a hell hellish place. Uh, where can I find your master? Why is he waiting for us?
Uh, so your master thinks he's God. And where are the ants? Uh, that's insignificant to him. But what about his ship? for enough of this. I'm here to kill your master, Tobin. Either you help me or stand this side. If you would have you saved Tobin, if you would have saved Onderon Trader, then listen to me and listen well. Once he destroys Telos, then Onderon will be among those he will destroy next. As you said, he cares nothing for Onderon. If you do not help us, that's what's going to happen. It's not just going to be Telos he will destroy, but the entire galaxy just to feed his appetite. He has touched Onderon since the invasion, since he helped you, and he will come back for it later on. If you're truly loyal to your home world, uh, unlike your uh, General Falku, then you will help us. I need someone to set off the proton cores on this vessel when we give the signal. Maybe. But right now, we need all the help we can get. I know why Tobin did what he did. He's loyal to his world. And that should be something. That should count for something at least. Let us go. Send in the final core, Mark Form. We still needed to kill the master that controls the ship, or Teos will still be finished. Jesus. Is there anything you need from your cell? We do not have much time, Jesus. Whatever you attend to do you quickly.
is different than last time. A few thesis. Thesis has come to terms with the death of her world and has calmed the hatred within herself. This has given her a stronger connection to the force and bonused her force points. She has made peace with the past. I'm happy for her. Now we go to the bridge and to finish off Thesis' master. Otherwise, Telos will still be destroyed, and it will be in a worse state than what Malik left it. the bridge. Going ahead to put a stop here to after these messages, folks. So this has gone by the spy sign off for now.